Hey everybody, this is the first time we're going to do something like this. It's uh, very new for me, um, and I hope it's something that you enjoy. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a series of videos to introduce our new top of the line uh, product that we're coming out with called Signature Oil Paintings. Uh, si if you've been to our studio, you see we have a signature color portrait. Um, this is uh, another step beyond. In fact, it's a quantum leap beyond. It is a fully painted uh, portrait. And by painted, I mean oil painted. It starts with a camera capture, but it's, um, it then goes through a process where I do a digital manipulation painting. It's hard for me to call it painting when it doesn't involve a brush in my hand, but it feels like painting when I do it. Um, we then lay down pigment on 100% uh, cotton canvas, and we then varnish that, and then I actually do hand-painted oils on the very top layer. So, in effect, this is 100% an oil painting. There are many products that are similar out there that people call them hybrids, uh, mixed media, whatever you want to call it. The end result is archival oils that are the same oil paintings you would see hanging in any museum. This is the first video. So what I'm going to show in this video is the very first step after we do a photographic capture. Um, meaning we've got an image. It's a nice image. We like it right we're going to say okay this is we're going to take this now and turn it into a painting now <laughs> Bea our assistant if you're watching you're going to be very happy because we are going to be using your daughter Valentina for an uh, image we took of her uh, a while back when I was looking for images for samples I thought gosh this is really good for what I'm trying to show in this little series so this series will take it all the way from photograph through uh, finished painting. You will actually see every step that we do to create um, these artworks for your home. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to switch to show the digital image that is in the, the format where I, we talk about the digital painting. So you may or may not be able to see right now uh, how much of this is brush stroked or not. I'm going to zoom in here in a second. This is not finished. I've just done a part of it, but we can go in even tired. So when you go in, you can see the brush strokes and you can also see some of the hairs are still there. They're not brush stroked yet. Her eyes are not finished yet, but you can begin to see um, where this becomes a true painting. It's no longer a photograph, right? We Everything has become, and my painting style is very impressionistic. I love getting away from a total reality of um, the look. And when the oils are applied to the canvas, you really, really see um, how it's, it, is, it changes it. And because we can't do this in the studio right now, it's very frustrating. It, it, those of you who know us, know how much of a people person I am and, and I, I really thrive off of working with people but for right now we have to deal with this so I wanted to do this and just we've never done this as a step-by-step -step of any of our products and if if this is something you guys enjoy I would really like to hear from you because uh, we can certainly do more of this but this is the first step you've seen how it's going to look uh, in a digital uh, a digital first step. Uh, I can't call it, I can't bring myself to call it a painting. Uh, in other videos, I'll show you some of my own paintings, which during this, this quarantine time, I've been doing quite a few of them. I haven't painted for years, but I, I have to have an artistic outlet. So I started picking up the paintbrush again. Uh, I think my daughter's happy about it. She's a very accomplished painter. And we do two totally different styles, which I totally love. But that's, that's the start for right now. Hopefully we will um, have the other video when I'm ready to lay, the next video will happen when, I'm, when the image is ready to be brought onto canvas for what I call a digital underpainting. Um, and then I will show you 
some steps of that. Once that's completed, we'll move on to the actual application of oils. So I hope this is something you enjoy. If it is, let us know, please. We can, uh, we'd love to talk to you guys and we, and we want to hear back from you too. You guys be healthy and stay safe out there. Okay.